perfect so this is working perfectly fine our roller is being detected and uh, this this actually confirms that the yolo v7 custom train model converted into a tensor rt engine is working perfectly fine on jetson xavier hello and welcome to rocket systems youtube channel so in our last video we converted yolo v7 tiny pre-trained model into a tensor rt engine on jetson xavier now in this video we are completely going to focus on how you can convert the custom yolo v7 tiny model into a tensor rt engine on jetson xavier so without wasting any time let's get started okay so i have already cloned this repository jetson yolo v7 tensor rt and i have already installed all the libraries which we need and if you don't know you can install all the libraries and the python packages mentioned in this setup file once you have installed everything then only you will be able to convert your uh, yolo models into a tensor rt engine so i have also copy pasted my bash.pt file so this is the custom train yolo v7 tiny model and i've also copy pasted this toys.mp4 and we are just going to use this for the inferencing now what we need to do is i think let's start converting this custom model into the tensor rt engine so i'll just open this build steps dot file and let's also open up a terminal let's move inside our directory now here we'll simply run the this file oops So this is going to convert the PT file into the WTS file and then we will use the WTS file to convert into the TensorRT engine. Okay, so this is done. Uh, let's just quickly see. So this is the bash.wts file which we have just converted. Now what we need to do next is that we need to move inside the YOLO v7 directory and then create a directory called build. Then we'll move inside the build directory and then we will copy our bash.wts file here and because this is the custom trained model so we also need to update the number of classes so inside the yolo v7 directory inside include directory there's a file called config.h we will open this file and then inside this uh, we need to update this knum classes so in our in my custom model file i have three classes so i will mention three here now let's close this save okay now let's go back to our terminal and let's simply run cmake perfect so this is done now we can simply run make command Okay, so the make command is also now complete. Next, we need to build our engine files. So for that, we will simply run YOLO v7 minus s bash dot wts bash dot engine and then t. So because we are using the tiny model, that's why we are using t. If you are using any other model, then you'll need to update this accordingly. So 
so the engine file is now successfully built on Jetson Xavier now next thing is we need to test this so if you want you can test this on the images but as of now I don't have the images so we will directly test this on the video file so let's go back and let's open this app dot file now inside this we first need to rename this because the name of our engine file is bash dot engine and then let's also rename this because we are going to do the inferencing on our toys.mp4 video file let's close this and another thing which we need to change is we need to update the classes in this particular file so because as of i mean because this is made for the pre-trained model but because we are using the custom model file so we cannot use these classes so let's comment this out and let's write our own code here so this is an important step so if you are doing inferencing for your uh, custom model you need to update this particular file so roller car and then last class which we have is phone perfect so let's save this and now let's try to run the python code to see how it's performing Let's open up a terminal and let's run the code. Perfect. So this is working perfectly fine. Our roller is being detected and uh, this, this actually confirms that the YOLO V7 custom train model converted into a Tensor RT engine is working perfectly fine on Jetson Xavier. So that's all for this video. Thank you for watching this video. Please like, share and subscribe to the channel.